just run, 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 run. There could be something heavy coming in. I'm gonna die in one hit. I always said I don't wanna die in two minutes, bro. How's it going, everybody? My name is Armando. Welcome back to another Dead Frontier video, everybody. So, guys, I had to do it. I had to change up the damn gear after so many years that I've been using it for a while. As you can tell, I got rid of the race cannon because in the death row, I just can't use it, man. That or I just suck, but it just doesn't have the knockback that this little thing here right has. The, the Raptor X9. It's really, really good, man. I can't stop using it, dude. It's just a good weapon to have in death row when there's a huge mob or like a random horde spike or aggro spike. It's a really good weapon. And of course, I got the Sand Scorcher. Not the best thing in the world, obviously, when it comes to knockback, but the fact that it can just destroy the, the horde down in a couple of like not even minutes but probably seconds if i do it right and the last thing i had to really get is the rust hound 37e the fact that it can wash shot everything in the death row is something i really needed because i was using the x uh dusk enforcer and that was taking too many hits and that's really bad of course i had the other one the hellstorm is good as well in terms of like bosses and you know trying to slow down everything else but again just wasn't cutting it and obviously i've been in the work in progress of my implants as you can tell i just didn't really want to spend money in the game anymore back then so i just kind of gave up trying to get anything better but i figured you know what let's just spend a bit of coin here and there and just get some upgrades for example i got the violence implant not too much i know but it's something at least i got the scorchstone implant which i got when it came out uh two percent movement eight percent damage you guys know the gist and obviously I invest, I invest in a celerity implant, which is the plus 11% movement speed, which again, it helped out tremendously now looting. Last but not least, the versi uh, versatility implant, which you got all this stuff, especially because I love looting. It's my favorite part of the freaking game, honestly. It was also in the fact that we have all these new like um, things to kind of just go around and try to get when we loot out there. I've always been a looter. I love looting in Death Frontier. It's just something I love to do. I put like music in the background and I just zone out or I put a song. It's like... I'm just a weird dude when it comes to this game. I don't really like doing things like hunting bosses or anything. I just like doing like this type of crap. And of course, you know, I've also been working on getting a lot of loots. I've been getting a little lucky out there. I got a Hunter Implant, a 577 Rex, and a nice Ripsaw, which is nice. But overall, yeah, guys, uh, basically my goal for this game now is to get your level 325 first of all. To get like a Dawn Mesh or something, because that armor looks pretty cool. Try to get at least 70-80% speed boost. I had a comment saying 80%, that's rookie numbers. I'm like, listen bro, I just need something where I can run away fast as hell. Because my philosophy is, if they can't touch you, they can't kill you. And that's for me in every game. If they can't touch you, they can't kill you. So yeah, i rather just focus on speed than damage really. If there's like an implants coming out that have like any type of speed um, increase, I would just take it. But yeah. Yeah, level 325 i already got the gear that works out from this you know in this meta and obviously i had to just buckle down and get the freaking tatakao you know i had to i had to i had to. for so many years i didn't get it because i hated the look of the tata but it's it's it's, it's kind of growing on me kind of <coughs> but yeah i'm just gonna make a quick loot run uh for this video i mean i could just end it here but really i want to sh showcase what this does in the death row i hope i don't die in like the next minute because that will be very embarrassing but yeah uh without further ado let's just transition to the death row let's go okay so here we are uh nice good old you know market that's right next to the hospital honestly it's a nice place to to barricade it's just one door you don't have to spend two barricades because barricades in the freaking death row are like 25k each man that's that's insane uh i should have probably yeah i should have probably checked for uh for anything are there bandits no there might be a boss so let's just run 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 there could be something heavy coming in i'm gonna die in one hit i always said i don't want to die in two minutes bro let's just run just go just go to the uh yeah just just go to the desk just go to the hospital it's easy actually i just saw that there's a nest here and i'm gonna try to put it on to showcase the boss showcase the damage this thing does let's see if i can last more than two minutes Shit, I have to speed now. Alright, I have to be very careful because these things are gonna pop up from behind. And if they get from me from behind, I am dead. Hi there. Yep, there he is. There's one. There's two. I don't know how much damage you do, but I don't wanna find out. So yeah, I mean what better way to showcase the damage on these things than, you know, in the fight with a boss. Oh yeah, so much better. Look at that. I'm able to like pretty much just run away easier. Ooh, but I'm not able to walk through walk through light poles. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you can't touch me. Can't touch this. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, per nah, I'm not taking that out. Last time I did that, yeah, I got you, Jeep. But yeah, guys, this dim, this, this little thing here is just insane. The, 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 the knockback is just crazy. I, listen, the race cannon will always be an unlimited weapon, but I prefer. I mean, Armando isn't the best player in the world for this game, really. It's just, it's just, it is what it is. So I'm just trying to, really, just get to a level where you know, 
I'm able to handle this stuff without having to die every two minutes. Because, again, I hate dying, dude. Dying, nobody likes dying. You know, who likes dying? I don't like dying. Do you like dying? I don't like dying. That, that speed boost just made a huge difference in, like, the way I'm able to survive now. Obviously, you have the Rust Helm, which does the amazing damage of 780-something for me. Some people can hit a thousand with this thing because they have the implants. I'll get there. Not really. <laughs> But yeah guys, my, my goal in this game is pretty much just to kind of get as strong as possible because I kind of did fall off a lot <laughs> in terms of gear. So yeah, the next goal is level 325. I don't know when I'll go for that. I have the Sand Scorcher and I've been to um, the Wasteland and it's not that bad really. It really isn't. It's pretty easy to kill those things. And as I always tell people when it comes to fighting bosses, just run around the block, disperse the aggro because 9 times out of 10 you're going to die by the aggro. Almost guaranteed. You're going to die by the aggro. So you want to just disperse the aggro, that way it's just you and the boss, and nothing else. Th just be careful from these guys, they come out from time to time. Just don't get touched by them, alright? Yeah, there you go, there you go, there you go. And even and when I have to hold ship, it's like, I just run away so quick. I love this, I love having speed. <laughs> it makes me giggle. Look, I have the tennis core right there that I could've used, but I'm like, nah, I don't trust myself enough to go in there and get stuck with these guys yet. Like, because one of them blows up and it just causes, like, a lot of disruption. I, I love the fact that Clayton also added the, uh... The health bars, they're really, really nice. I like that. It kind of like, instead of you just being like, bro, how much longer? It's like, okay, we're close to killing them, so I'm glad. Obviously, I recommend single player more than multiplayer, because multiplayer is just buns for that. <laughs> but anyway, there you go. Let's loot, and oh, let's see the new loot. Oh, oh, oh battle axe, Jesus Christ. That's just not what we're looking for. Okay, you know what? That's one out of what? One out of what? Five loot? So yeah, let's, let's check on the next one. Let's go. Here we go, next loot. Oh, okay. Sheesh, Jesus, it's not looking so good for me. Not looking good for me at all. Wait, is that? No, it's not, it's just a random loot. Okay, cool. I'm like, did I miss something? All right, let's look at this one. Oh, oh my God, bro, what? Bro, no way. The Armando curse continues, bro. I think that's it. No, there's one more over there. Come on, brother. I need something decent, bro. I need something decently okay. You know, something okay-ish. Please be something decent, don't be crap, I beg you. So, oh, I mean, we had an okay -ish. <laughs> But yeah, guys, let me just barricade this up, and let's just go back to the, uh, well, I guess we can say a little, like, outpost here, and I'll see you guys there. Yeah. So yeah, guys, pretty much the gist of it, I had to make a change, and yeah, I, I'm happy with what I did. It's, it's a very good setup. Again, you have the Ross Hound, Sand Scorcher, and the Raptor. Just good weapons to get you out of anything, pretty much. Uh, but again, I'm more impressed by this thing. Really, <laughs> just a small little SMG and it does that much freaking damage out in the, uh, in the wasteland. Out there in the inner city in Death Row. It's just, it's very nice. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. Uh, I think it was quick. I'm not too sure. But uh, yeah, without further ado, it's Ramon and off. Love you guys, and I can't wait to see you guys soon. All right, take it easy. Bye. <laughs>